today's video, I am doing another Draw This In Your Style Challenge. And I've chosen more images off Instagram. I've chosen more, um, well, I've chosen different artists off Instagram. And yeah, let's kind of get into them. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you can see more content like this. Also, leave me a like and a comment below. Alright, so in today's video, like I said, I'm doing the Draw This In Your Style Challenge. And um, I've chosen to do um, the piece that you see here on the screen. I just thought it was so cute. And yes, I want to put my, um, my spin on, my version on art piece. Starting out with the line art. Now the line art really didn't take that long for me to do. I'm using the regular um, G pen pen inside of Clip Studio Paint Pro. I really love this program. Soon I will be posting content on my animation where you guys can see me um, do animations, web comics, and manga. That's coming, you know, sometime later this year. But I do have another channel um, alongside of this channel, and it's my t shirt printing channel. And if you want to subscribe to it, you can. It's called Sundays Printing. And I should be posting a video this week. Improve my skills as an um, artist, not only as a traditional artist, but a digital artist. So you'll be seeing me um, do both. I should. I'll be creating traditional art and digital art here on this channel. Also, I have um, challenges I will be participating in. I know I'm kind of late to the party with a lot of these challenges. But, you know, better late than never. And they look fun. And, you know, I just want to put my two cents in on it. Next week, I will be dropping some videos. Me doing art. I kind of want to turn it into, like, a little mini-series. So, stay tuned for that. Here it's time to add the color, and I'm using going to use the colors from the original art. My recreation of it kind of reminds me of film off Scooby Doo. And I might do a um, Scooby Doo fan art, fan art variety piece of work. I might do a Scooby Doo fan art or fan art Friday on my Instagram. And 
here I'm just coloring in the vines using the same frame I picked from the original picture. Now looking back, I would have um, um, alternated the uh, color, color green on the leaves just to make it a little more interesting and dynamic. Yeah, one of my favorite parts of this piece is pattern to the jam. A little, little touch on the original piece, and I wanted to keep that the same. Alright, you guys, this is the final look. Let me guys know what you think in the comments below. Like I said, leave a like. And if you want to share this video, uh, I would appreciate it. And that was peace. This piece right here was really fun to draw. I really like this question in particular. So I thought it would be fun to recreate this in my own style. I really like, um, the painterly, well, it's like almost painterly look, or what almost graphic look. It's, it's a mixture of both. Of um, if you guys know what I'm talking about, if you get what I'm saying, um, in this person's original piece here. So here is me drawing a sketch, trying to figure out what the face would look like, or you know how I want the face to look. Another reason I chose this piece was because this has, um, the character in this piece has braids in it, in it on her head, mm -hmm. and uh, I really want to get better at drawing braids. I mean, it's simple, but sometimes you can look at it and confused or you know, kind of forget. Like once you kind of learn it a little bit, kind of forget it. Which is, in my case, like I kind of knew how to draw the braid at one point and then I slipped the gap because I kind of stopped drawing drawing them. And so I just kind of want to re-entry myself into drawing the braids. I think they're unique to draw in the drawing on the character. Another thing that I'm okay at is drawing fabric on a character. I need to definitely improve my skills on that. Um, now on, I kind of want to just practice, you know, um, just practice drawing my weaknesses, whether that be like figure drawing, you know, um, and all types of different other things. I also want to improve in um, drawing, you know, characters with wing and shadow. I should have been um, practicing on practice here and there, but not giving great effort. But that's going to change. I want to make sure I have um, a great understanding of how to light a character. Because I do want to, you know, improve my skills. So, doing those things and taking my art to the next level. Now here I made her 
zipper area. I don't know, I just like um, kind of doing that to character sometimes where, you know, they have normal size clothes but have like oversized um, accessories or something just to kind of emphasize. And I like when characters have like graphics on the t-shirt. I thought the star was a nice touch, so. This is a to recreate. And now I move on to coloring. As you see here, it's me trying to add color um, and kind of paint. But I was locked onto it way too long with this video. And I'm already like, lagging behind on posting on this channel so and i, I kind of wanted to find this up uh, posting a weekly video and this would have taken way too long so i was like ah, no we're just going to add the color the um graphic one you will see me create pieces with the painter look because i think that is so cool i couldn't make her um what is it? The same color as it was in the piece because it would have been too dark for the line art because my line had be um, like a, more, a deep maroon, a red. All the other colors for the most part I kept the same. But here you see adding lines, adding red lines outline um, the shadows I'm going to be filling the red lines up with the red color and eventually you know change the blend mode you know to kind of make it look more so like a shadow so here again, I'm just outlining my shadows. If you're an artist, just comment down below. Let me know if you guys enjoy um, this particular challenge, draw the same style challenge. And if so, have you guys participated in doing any of these? And here I'm just adding the highlights to her hair. And actually, I would have done the highlights a bit differently looking back because the highlights they look a little, uh, they look kind of scattered. And they don't really look so uniform. You know, I would have done the, the highlighter here. But it's okay. And here is the final piece to this particular artwork. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up a comment below share my video and come back for some more by subscribing to this channel and hitting the notification bell guys in the next video